imagine you're asking for a detective and then he just burst out, Anna, take me back, please take me back. Life wasn't easy. <laughs> Voice acting, great. I was a freshly divorced duck. Oh. Not able to pay next month's rent. That's very sad. Not that I had paid for it this month yet. Um, yeah, divorce can be pretty expensive. <laughs> My brain felt foggy. And I was trying to remember. What? Where did all my money go? Uh, it depends. Knowing a little, little bit about the legal field, well, it could be alimony, child support. It really depends on <laughs> your circumstances. I had to retrace last night's steps. Let's do it. Deductions are a vital part of a detective's work. A uh, name added to clues. Find clue words by questioning persons and inspecting your surroundings. Okay. Uh, enter clue words into the blank space to solve the deductions. Uh, like Miss Marvel likes to eat. Okay. All right. Ooh, nest egg. Okay, these are the words where we fill, fill in for our rent. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> we love a good spinny chair. No messages. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I won't be needing this badge anymore. Are we quitting? I guess I can keep it as a souvenir. What badge is it? My new job as the duck detective isn't going any better, though. Oh, were we like a cop? <sighs> we, uh, duck detective added to clues. Well, if things keep going badly, I can always sell it online. <laughs> I guess. Keep us a memento, why not? So what else? Can we sleep in our office? <laughs> This fresh smell. It looks kind of dirty. Oh, sweet spongy <laughs> loaf. Oh, you keep me safe at night. All right. Okay. <laughs> what about here? <sighs> Is there a case board? <gasps> Is that her wife? I took that photo of her in a secluded tulip field. Is she like a goose or something? Or is she another duck? We spoke for hours under the stars that night. Now, nothing. She doesn't even answer my texts. What'd you do? <laughs> What'd she do? I can't judge him. Maybe, maybe it was she was in the wrong. I can't believe Anna actually filed the divorce papers. Well, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> it seems like we still love her wife. Second overdue notice. Okay. I wonder at what point they start kicking people out. That's a fair question. Probably soon after the second. I have everything I need to solve this now. All right. Okay. So rent, bread, and tulips. So blank spent his or her money. So money on blank for... So we had tulips. Where did the tulips come from? We did have a ton of bread on our, on our bed. Okay, so this is the loaf he was talking to. I don't see any tulips. Spent, uh, so he, he must have spent his money. Duck Detective spent his last money on bread for himself. Yes! <laughs> uh, my proudest moment. We gotta eat, a duck's gotta eat. But, toast. <laughs> forget. Yeah, I guess I prefer to just eat bread than do anything else. What's up? Hannah! She okay? I'm a different duck now. <laughs> I haven't had a, a slice of bread in weeks. He's lying, Anna. We're, we're lying. You have to believe me! <clears throat> Anna? Oh. Is it not Anna? Yeah, if you're speaking to the <laughs> duck detective. Can you imagine you're asking for a detective and then he just burst out, Anna, take me back, please take me back. <laughs> I will be not so reassured in this detective. Prison. All right. Now, be there in an hour. Cool, let's go. Who is it? What mystery will they have? Fair bus. <laughs> It's so sad. 
out in the rain. I spent more than half of my remaining cash on the bus fare. Jeez. And here I was. Why couldn't they come to us? In front of their bus office. Some sort of rundown call center. It looks okay from the outside. I better crack this case. Or I won't even have enough money to make it back home. Oh, dang. Let's definitely do that. <laughs> let's find some stuff. New bus route starting in August. Visit the scenic mountains of South Sitia. Ooh. I'd always tell Anna we'd go there one day. <laughs> yeah, we have to let Anna go at this point. She made her decision. We have to respect that. Anything else out here? <gasps> we have someone picketing. We do not cross picket signs here. What's up? I'm staying here until I get my money back. We also want money. <laughs> Let's help. You, uh, sound unhappy. <laughs> did, did you know you were sounding a little bit unhappy back there? Are you upset? I bet I am! <laughs> Their stupid buses always arrive late! It happens with buses. I came back from a work trip to the west and arrived here at three in the morning! How far away is your job? And they don't even want to give me a refund. Hmm, I guess it depends. I know buses can obviously be delayed. And if you're riding the bus, you obviously have to know that. But if they're like 12 hours behind, that might be a little crazy. How much did you pay? Um, two schmark. It's the principal, I guess. <laughs> but that's not the point! <laughs> it's about the principal. That's what I said, yeah. Um, okay. I don't cross picket signs, but I don't know about him. It seems two, what, two bucks? Not worth it. Just don't ride the bus anymore. I could already tell based on her face that the receptionist was a tough one. <laughs> she wouldn't make life easy for me. But I had to make my way into the office. Okay, but I thought we were invited here. Hi. Let us in. <gasps> Can we pick this up? I think she would appreciate that. I'm Guess the not. duck detective. <laughs> I'm here to investigate a case. What's up? Okay. <laughs> Do you work here? Uh, yeah. Um, no. No. Then I can't let you in. What if we pick up your cup of pens on the floor? But I've been hired by someone from Bearbus. We're here for business, lady. Who hired you? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I didn't catch their name. So I think it's an orange because maybe we have to find a name. Listen, buddy. Name added to close. You Don't better buddy get me. Out of here, or I'll have to call security. Okay, I'm probably gonna stick around and peruse your office. There's always more to people than you might think. People in orange. I should take a closer look and figure out what she's about. It seems like she just wants to clock in, clock out. Uh, what can we do? Inspection. Use a magnifying glass to find clues and press E to uncover them. <gasps> Tear, sad. <gasps> Aww. What's, what's going on? It's like a band or something. Keychain, boy band, <laughs> K-pop band. As she's sad, she can't go to a concert. Is that what it is? Name tag, last name. Wins the Myer. Okay. You're still here? My bad. I'll leave you alone. Rude. Okay. What else we got? Uh, I swear to God, if someone steals my mug again, I'll end them. Jeez. Mug stolen. I understand it's a little much, but don't be so mean. Thor from CS is way too loud. I can hear her keyboard all the way to my desk. Oh my gosh, I always hate that as well. It's one of my biggest pet peeves. First name, Laura. Oh wait, is her name Laura? It's Sophie's birthday next Thursday. Just saying. Don't forget, it's Sophie's birthday. Okay, and then here, suggestions. What else? I'm assuming there has to be one other thing here. It's a very hostile office. Oh. 
first name Sophie. I got that. Oh, never mind. I didn't. Okay. Cool. These are quite mundane. Um, if you're stealing someone's things, don't do it. <laughs> I should be able to deduce her name now. Okay. It's important to work out a suspect's name to crack the case. Enter their first and last name into the slots below their portrait in your journal suspect page. Okay. Okay. Uh, her last name's for sure that. So she could be her Laura, Laura or Sophie. So let me go back real quick. What was her name again? Laura from CS. Customer support. I can hear her keyboard all the way to my desk. It's Sophie's birthday next Thursday. Hmm. Let's see if we can find something else. Oh! Sorry! Whoever your name is! Seven today. Oh, if the, today's her birthday, it could be Sophie. Smiley, happy. <gasps> Maybe someone didn't remember her name. Maybe that's the problem. Giraffe Q. <laughs> Giraffe Q. <laughs> okay, today. So today is the birthday. Tomorrow is Friday. Uh huh. Need to remember to collect my dry cleaning. <laughs> All right, so let's go back. So if today is her birthday, she's Sophie, right? Maybe that's why. I mean, she wants to go to the concert. Yeah, I think her name is Sophie. I'm gonna go with Sophie. Sophie. Sophie Winthamimer. Hopefully that's right. Looks like it is. Okay. I should be able to figure out what's going on with her. What I think it's going on. So today is her birthday. I'm assuming no one's told her she wants today off. Because obviously she should. Notes in the deduction, deduction. section. <laughs> and she wasn't able to go see her favorite concert. Um, okay. It's a receptionist. A lot of things. So Sophie is feeling sad. She's feeling cute. She's... I guess if she was the concert, maybe she'd be feeling cute and happy. <laughs> Sophie's feeling sad because Sophie has remembered her birthday. Let's go with that. Oh, two of your things are wrong. So Sophie's feeling sad because nobody has remembered her birthday. That was close. That's why she's making such a face. I would too, honestly. I should try and cheer her up. Do we have a present? Do you want pens? I would be giving her her pens back. Um, let's talk. You're still here? Happy birthday! I'm just here to wish you a happy birthday. <gasps> yes, we thought about it. You're in our thoughts, Sophie. How did you know? We didn't go through everything and obviously make a mess. <laughs> Just another one of Duck Detective's great deductions. <laughs> huh? We just know, Sophie. <laughs> uh, anyway, that was really nice of you. Of course, my pleasure. No one else remembered. Can you believe it? I'm sorry about that. If you know my birthday, you must have a connection to someone here. Yeah, I nothing to do with the suggestions block or the calendar in the corner. Don't worry about that, Sophie. Here's a key card to the office. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, bear bus. Office key card. Let's get that. Thank you, Sophie. Happy birthday. I hope it's the best one yet. Let's go. It says server room. Okay. It's locked. Okay, so let's go the other way then. Don't mind us, Sophie. Bye. Hi. Which one of you guys called us? Oh, that guy's freaking out. The stained carpets and peeling wallpaper exuded a stench of stale coffee and abandoned, <laughs> abandoned dreams. dreams. Uh, well, it could be they didn't want to work in a call center. I knew I couldn't stay long or it would rub off on me. <laughs> we don't want that. <laughs> the last oh, straw. The last straw! Are you quitting? The Regerson needs to be fired! <laughs> or you want to fire someone? I'll see what I can do. Okay. Who are you? 
I'm the detective. Do you have a problem? Nope. We're just, you know, if you have one, just call our damn hotline. You know what? I now actually support the picketer outside. I'm Eugene McQuacklin. McQuacklin. The duck detective. A client hired me to investigate a case. Anyone? <sighs> Wanna call? Why and say, didn't you let just me know? Say so? You didn't give me a chance. It's time we put an end to the awful lunch death. <gasps> How dare you. All we need to fire him is some evidence from the upper management. <laughs> I'll give you steal someone's lunch as a firing. I'll be in my office. All right. We'll find out. First, I had to find out who works here and what their jobs are. Got it. I needed to find my client as well. All right. Inspecting the crime scene will be important too. Got it. But this is a <gasps> demo. No. So you'll have to wait for the rest of the game to be made. <gasps> no. Thanks for playing. some quacks for the road all right so overall impressions duck detective verse it's super cute <laughs> i honestly love games that are kind of mystery based and obviously cozy so i think it's the perfect mix i love the characters the voice acting uh chef's kiss <laughs> um but i really want to know who did it i think it's kind of cool to be able to do some puzzles and honestly investigate i love investigating so i think i might play more of this when it actually releases I don't think it's an actual set date just yet, but if you're interested in playing the demo as well, feel free to check out Steam.